Back last month, in a disgusting post, horrible villain Beg Ed Brown confirmed that he was back with Liz Woods. I was not surprised by this news, but unfortunately, no matter how abusive Ed is to Liz, she keeps returning. And now Ed publicly calls her his ball and chain. He probably thinks it's funny. Big Ed Brown unfortunately will never change. I just hope Liz Woods realizes that one day. A couple of days ago, Ed posted a picture. The picture showed him and Liz attending a National Wrestling Alliance event. Ed and Liz were smiling together. My NWA ball and chain, Ed captioned the photo. If anyone doesn't know a ball and chain, it's a classic misogynistic reference to a wife. From the 17th century to the mid-20th century, heavy iron balls were attached to the ankles of prisoners in the former British Empire to restrain their movements. That is, toxic men referred to their wives as people who restrained or prevented them from enjoying life. This equates to them feeling imprisoned in their consensual marriage. Is Ed making a joke here? Of course he is, but is the joke disrespectful to Liz? Absolutely. If even Ed wasn't an own misogynist, it still counts as a mocking phrase. Remember, Ed's disgusting behavior is not limited to women unlucky enough to be in a relationship with him. A former colleague accused Ed of sexual misconduct at a time when he first gained viral fame. Essentially, Big Ed punishes Liz for standing up for herself. He humiliates her, hurts her feelings, and more. I've seen it, you've seen it all happen on camera. Unfortunately, he somehow manages to regain her favor. I've seen more of their breakups than reconciliations, so how he tricks her is still being determined. On the other hand, he may be just taking advantage of her insecurity. Ed probably keeps convincing Liz that he can change or already has. The man will soon be 58 years old. He's had over half a century to become a good person. Is it possible at this point? Is it possible at all? Liz has to ask herself this. Thanks for tuning in, folks. Until the next video.